Welcome back to Rocket City. Jeff Eaton, eating his way to the Heisman watch. It's not really a surprise either. This man has been dominant. We played five games this season, 2,300 passing yards, 23 touchdowns, three picks. And when you go back and look at those picks, it was because I pressed the wrong button once, we had a desperation throw against Alabama to get like a third and 30 and we couldn't get it. At least two thirds of those are not his fault whatsoever. So Jeff Eaton has been essentially perfect this year. Not only has he been perfect through the air, he's been pretty good on the ground as well. 423 rushing yards, that's an average of seven per rush. He's averaging 84 yards a game. He's got four touchdowns and he's only fumbled the ball three times. I know it's kind of skewed because we're still on the Sun Belt, but Jeff Eaton is having the most productive season of any quarterback out of the three series I've done so far. I haven't beat anyone who is really like a, an impressive team so far, and that's why our rank is still currently at 81. Lee Corso's finally jumping on the Rocket City train. And no, that shaky bar on defense, it doesn't even phase me. In the rain for this one, hopefully it doesn't mess up our offensive production, because we've been a fun football team to watch. Our defense, yeah, I don't want to talk about that. Oh, that's not even who we were throwing to, but I'll take it. Samuel Wusu just happened to be in the area. Nice. Whoa, that is an errant pass. Oh, nearly picked. Rough start for Jeff Eaton. Pitches it out. And Roy Kinn is there. Ooh, it seems like this rain is messing everybody up. I feel like being fancy. So we're going with the the pass. It's working. Can we get a block? Downfield. Terrell Hughes, come on. You're supposed to be fast. The trick play worked though. Carlos Willis. He played a little quarterback in high school. There we go. Danny Dorito. He's gone. Touchdown. Back-to-back -back plays of 35 yards. And now we're in the end zone. You can't stop Rocket City's offense for long. RCU, love to see that. <laughs> oh, Eaton Beaver, that was pathetic. Oh, way to jump at him. A little sweep, and that looks like a face mask. Can we tackle him? No, we can't. Shocker. It's just so bad. Whoa, that was almost a gift. Throw the bomb. Oh, deflected it away. I'm just going to stay at home here, wait for him. And I still can't tackle him. Jeez. God. It's like we're nothing. They're running against air. A light breeze would be more intimidating than our tackle attempts. Whoa, what the? That's off brand for you. Nice job. Finally moving forward with the running game. We could bomb them deep here. You know what? If they keep pressing us up like this, teams keep doing this. That's why you keep throwing it deep. Like, look at this. Can he get to it? Yes, he can. It looked like it was out of reach, but Josh Merrill is just too damn fast. An absolute hot dot. This offense is just so smooth. You can't stop Josh Merrill. There goes William Newton. There we go. He's like the only one who can tackle in open space. Ooh, just errant on a screen pass. Is this real life? We're forcing a field goal for the first time in several games. Oh, we, for a second, I thought we were going to get in there to block it, but he sinks it 17-14. I see you on that little post. Dot. And Lonnie Clayton has the moves, too. Whenever he gets the ball, it's something to watch. Lead him. In the pocket, touchdown again. Josh Merrill gets out there so quickly. It's just so easy to throw him the football. And even his 57 catching, it doesn't make him drop the ball that often. 
I mean, why are you trying to cover him like that? Josh Merrill's gone again, man. Look at all this space to run. He's just so fast. He's just trolling him. School record for receiving yards in a season. And he shattered it. He didn't even play like the first couple of games. He's so good. I'll take that. William Newton's going to the house. Read that screen pass all the way. Too easy. Now we're flooding South Alabama. Go RCU. Oh, it was almost back-to-back -back picks. We're in his head now. Stopped him short. And I'll call that timeout. Punt it my way. Just full send that. Josh Merrill. Oh, there's the drops. Give me time. Lonnie Clayton. He's got it. Oh, call that timeout. Four seconds. I want another heave. Full sending that to a Wusu. And that's going to hit the dirt. But that'll be the end of the half. Just padding the stats a little bit. 320 yards in the first half for Jeff Eaton. But now that it is halftime, let's hear from today's NIL sponsor, Hawthorne. Hawthorne is a premium men's grooming brand that makes it quick and easy to be your best with confidence. It's trusted not only by famous athletes Steph Curry, Zach Levine, and Tyrod Taylor, but fake virtual athletes like Terrell Hughes, Josh Merrill, and Samuel Wusu. What I love about Hawthorne is that they tailor every product specifically for you. The way this works is you take a quick and easy quiz on their website. To build your personal profile, they ask some common questions like how sensitive your hair and skin is, but also some fun questions like what's your preferred way to spend your weekend? Do you sit on the couch by yourself watching some sports? Or do you hit the town with the lats? For me, I found this really helpful because it gave Hawthorne the necessary info to find the products that I needed, like aluminum-free deodorant, refreshing shampoo, conditioner, body wash, and more. Hawthorne going the extra mile means they truly do not miss. But if you're not completely satisfied for whatever reason, they will retailer their products for you for free based on your feedback and pay for the shipping and all that good stuff, so there is truly no risk. So get ready for whatever comes your way this season by taking Hawthorne's quiz today by going to hawthorne.co and use promo code not the expert to get 10% off your first purchase. Once again, that's H A W T H O R N E dot C O, hawthorne.co, and use promo code not the expert to get 10% off your first purchase. Thanks again to Hawthorne for sponsoring this video. They dropped it. Oh, these poor kids. It's a flood now. Nice, nice. Get that running game going a bit. Oh, wow. That is not who I wanted to throw to. I was throwing a Y across the middle. There we go. William Newton's having a great game. Oh, couldn't get there in time. Jason Hudgens was in the region. He's trying to run. And there's three of us there waiting on him. Got him again. And we're there. Fourth and goal. Defense is stepping up. And he boots it through. 23 to 35. It's like they're just crashing on the run exclusively. Letting Owusu get a huge gain down there. Oh, they're on me. Able to dance around and pick up seven. That's crazy. He would have fall forward. There's a lane. Getting Terrell going. We're going full back in the backfield because it's fun. He's breaking a tackle. Got him wide open. Lonnie Clayton, they forgot about the tight end. Easy touchdown for Jeff Eaton. Number five on the game. He's going down. And William Newton gets another sack. Just elite production in this game. And he stopped short of it. Turnover on downs. That one should be the game. 
a clean victory for Rocket City. Jeff Eaton carrying us once again. No shocker here. I wanted to run the football today, but they just kept pressing us up on the line, which is strange because they know we love to throw the football. Another dominant performance from him. Chef Jeff Eaton is back at it, man. 362 passing yards, five touchdowns, one interception. Hey, Terrell Hughes actually led us in rushing yards today. Still only averaging 3.2 yards per carry, but he's uh, showing some improvement. And Josh Merrill, three catches, all of them for touchdowns. Just run him on streaks every play. Who's keeping up with him? William Newton was really, really good this game. Three TFLs, one sack, and a pick six. There it is. We've won five games in a row. If you made it to this point in the video, I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching. You're a legend in my book, and as for me, I am Drew Morris, big old Drewski, not the expert. And I'll see all you guys in my next video. Peace. Thank you to Patreon supporters, Tristan Stagner, Christian Tague, Jack Webb, Anthony Uhas, Tyler McGlynn, Zach Harper, Timbo Slice, Jacob Jordan, Wyatt, Richard Pizer, Jason Huerta, Tyler Cracker, Matt Woodruff, Casey Knox, Austin Gazzetti, Seth Washburn, and Rosalie Jarecki.